I haven't washed my hair in 300 days, so let's get the bits we need to try making some sea salt spray. Okay, a cup of warm water. There's actually really not much to it. It's just warm water, all natural sea salt, aloe vera gel, some essential oils if you want to, and a spray bottle. Okay, where is it? ILW6. Back down there. <laughs> also gonna get some of the best barbecue in Kansas City, in my opinion. Here we are, darling. Oh, there it is. <laughs> I was about to complain and say this Target never has stuff in the right place. Mate, what is this? Ghetto Gastro. Now, when I Googled it, this showed up as natural salt, but this is all natural. So we're going with that. Let's go pick up the barbecue. I just got noticed in the gym, actually, by a Scottish dude, I won't say his name, but it's such a surreal feeling. Like I'm just a dude who makes videos online. Like I just enjoy making videos and to think like, you know, a real person enjoys watching them. That's really cool to me. How you doing, sir? Doing good, man. How about you? I'm doing well, thank you very much. I have both back ones, but they're card only. Uh, that's perfect. Well, thank you very much. Thank you, sir. Have a good one. Take it easy, man. And now as a white family, maybe we can finally season our food. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Race joke. Yeah, that's a stop sign, you old cow. I'm not going to mix it in this video because I'll do a story thing, but it's one cup of warm water, filtered or distilled, one tablespoon of the sea salt, one teaspoon of hair gel or aloe vera gel, one to two drops of essential oils, and a clean spray bottle. You also need a measuring cup as an afterthought. That's on here. I feel like my hair already has quite a bit of volume, but we'll see what happens to it. From what I've seen, there's meant to be a technique too, so... Don't tell my wife. Oh, 